Good morning, good morning, good morning, 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 good morning, good morning to Adeline. Good morning, guys. Um, we are just hanging around the house today. Nothing much is really going on. Um, it is, I think it's 10 o'clock now. No, oh my god, it's 11.30. We woke up and we were just like hanging on the couch today. Just like watching some TV, catching up on some Facebook, some Instagram, and doing nothing. Just morning cuddles with my girl. Uh, today we are going to be cooking for Easter tomorrow. I have to cook a, I have to make like a broccoli salad and I have to make brownies. So we're cooking and baking today. I am dressed in my gym clothes today because I woke up and I said I'm going to go for a run today. And if I got dressed in normal clothes, I would have never, ow, just pulling my hair. So I put on gym clothes today because if I put on normal clothes, I would have never been motivated to go for a run. So I woke up, put on some gym clothes, and now I have to go for a run today because I'm in gym clothes. How many times did I just say the word gym clothes? I think I just said it like 10 times. So much just happened within the last 10 minutes. Like, I can't even explain it. I have to show you. I was in the living room and my curtain fell down. How does a curtain fall down? Like, I don't even understand. Like, it just came attached. So the curtain fell down. And then, as I was over here, there was a big old spider that I had to kill. And I didn't want to kill the spider. But I feel like because I have Adeline in the house now, I have to protect her from everything. Like, the spider was huge. And I feel like I had to kill it because I I would never want it to hurt Adeline or a biter. So I had no choice but to kill the spider. And I haven't killed a spider in like forever. So I have been obsessed with um, coconut mocha iced coffees from Dunkin Donuts. And they're just getting like, you know, it's expensive to keep making or buying them. So I'm going to try and make my own. Let's see how it works. All right, so I'm just using the Starbucks cup from Disney World because we all know I am obsessed. And I'm just gonna put some ice. That looks like an offering. Right? And I got my coffee chili. That is the leftover chicken that Mike didn't let me throw out because he swore he was gonna eat it. And it looks eaten, right? It's just gonna get thrown out, like always. Oh, and here's the coconut cream. I am obsessed with this, it's so good. So let's see how it works. Should I put the cream in first? Maybe I'll put the cream in first. the mocha part. Guys, it tastes just like it. Like, I nailed it. So good. I'm never buying it again. I could just make it at home. I'm so excited. Ready, set, Ready, set, Ready, lean back a little bit. Okay, ready? Here we go. Ready? Oh, lift, lift. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Look at the chubbiness. <laughs> Okay, go back. Ready? Lean. Yay! Adamin is so big. So big. So quick little story time for you guys. I was changing Adeline and I wanted to share it with you. So four years ago, 
I bought my cousin uh, a outfit for when she had her baby Abigail. Adeline's basically like her cousin. So Abigail passed the outfit back on to Adeline and it is my favorite outfit. I bought it four years ago because I fell in love with it and now my daughter gets to wear it and I think it is so like cute because I bought it for Abby and now my little girl is wearing it and it, it's just special. It can never be like thrown out or anything because I just feel like it, it's one of those outfits that are always just going to be handed down and handed down and handed down. So these little pants, these little like purple and pink cheetah pants and then this little shirt, little hoodie. How cute is it? It's adorable. I absolutely like am in love with this. Since when do we hold our own wubba nubs? Look at you, big shot. That doesn't go there, not in the eye. Since when do we hold our own wubba nubs? All right, guys, we're home. Adeline pooped out. She's exhausted. We walked for two miles, and she did really good. She didn't even wake up. She was literally sleeping the whole time. And then after we were done our walk, we went to a produce place that I live next to and we got like the ingredients for our salad. So now I'm going to make my salad, brownies, and dinner. Okay, so you need four cups of broccoli, some carrots. I just got like these little carrots because they're easier to cut. Red onion and some apples. And then you also need some, oh my god, I dropped the box on my head. Then you need some raisins, and I am going to throw in croutons. You're supposed to use walnuts, but I don't have walnuts, so I'm going to use croutons. So once you cut up all of your broccoli into little pieces, you are going to take your carrots, and you're going to cut up about one cup. Up all of my carrots, my salad's looking yummy now, and now I'm going to cut up my onion, and cut up two of these apples. The funniest thing that just happened, Mike was changing Adeline's diaper and he thought it was just pee because he doesn't change poop diapers. And then when he took off the diaper, he realized that there was a whole bunch of poop in it and he was like, oh my God. He was like, he was like, I need help, I need help. So I had to stop making my salad to go help. But I just put in the, um, uh, what are these called, raisins. It says use a half a cup, but I'm making like double the recipe, I guess. So I just kind of like, I like just looked. I didn't really measure it. So put in whatever you like want to put in it. And then the also um, the recipe calls for Greek yogurt, mayo, and um, apple cider vinegar and honey. Well, that's pretty expensive to buy all that. So I just actually found this, the apple cider vinaigrette um, by Ken's. And it's really good. And it, it like, it tastes exactly what it's supposed to taste like. That is it. It's really good too. I just tasted it. And then I'm also going to put these in, but I'm going to wait to put these in tomorrow because I don't want them to get like soft overnight. I want them to stay crunchy, but it's really good. I think everybody's going to like it. Adeline's taking a snooze. She's so cute when she sleeps. She's three months old today. And it's so sad because she's not a newborn anymore. She's like an infant. But she'll always be my baby, even when she's 20 years old. I want to film her three-month update, but I don't want to do it today. I'm not in the mood. I'll do it tomorrow. I don't really know if, if anything has really changed, though, since, like, last month. I guess it has. Like, like today, she, like, she grabbed for the first time and stuff like that. So, yeah, there has been a lot that's changed. Do you want to eat, eat? Do you want to eat? eat? Tonight. All right, Bubba's. Here you go. Here's your dinner. I had to use a paper plate because I was taking Binks's bowl um, to clean it today, and I broke it. So that is just added to the things that malfunction today. It is sound asleep. Oh, maybe she's waking up. I really want her to wake up though because it's eight o'clock. And she's been sleeping for like an hour now, and I don't want her to not be tired later. 
But then I feel so guilty waking her up if she's sleeping. Me and Adeline are in the den. We were just watching some videos. I think she's looking at herself. Baby, is that you? Is that little Adeline? That bassinet in the corner, I've never even used before. She hates it. She just she doesn't want any parts of the bassinet, so. I guess that was a waste of money. Hi, Bubba's. Hi, what are you doing? I can't bend over because Adeline is in my hand, but I'll pet you with my feet. I'll pet you with my feet. Ow, don't bite. You're hurting mommy. I was like sitting on my foot. Now my foot's all red. Ow, Binks. If you guys haven't checked out my Instagram before, definitely do so. My name is Veronica Page Guzman, of course, and follow me on Instagram. I got cool pics on here. The link is always down below in the description box. So check I'm out. about to go hop in the shower. My face is all nasty and greasy. And before I went in, I wanted to show you guys my self-tanner that I have been using. Where's it at right here? So this is the self tanner I'm using, and I like it a lot. It's the Jergens Natural Glow, and I think it works really good. Like you don't get like shrieky, and you don't get like that fake look. It looks really good. A friend recommended it for me, and I really like it. So I definitely recommend it, and I think that you should try. Good night, it. everybody. Good night. See, that's it for today's vlog. See, we're going. To the